the past few weeks, the Padres have been scratching and clawing to stay at the 500 mark. Well, they got some more challenging news today as it was announced that Fernando Tatis Jr., who had missed the last couple of games, is actually going to be going onto the IL with a stress reaction to his right femur. There's no timetable as to when he will be coming back. Not a cloud in the sky as we get it started from Petco Park in San Diego. Beautiful night as the Padres and Nationals going head to head. And Matt Waldron getting ready for tonight's start in game one. Trying to find it here with two down after walking Winker. A 2 2 pitch coming up to Manessis. And a swing and a miss struck him out. First K of the night for Matt Waldron. Ends the top of the first. Padres are coming up. 16th game here for Patrick Corbin. One and seven, five, six, but we talked about it back to back. Pretty good starts in the one two. Swing and a miss and a breaking ball way down and away. Here's Manny Machado. It's going to go the other way. Ball hit off the end of the bat, but Lane Thomas is there. Good start for Patrick Corbin, a 1 2 3 bottom of the first inning. Rosario's out on the fly to center. Now the batter's Kibert Ruiz. That's a good looking line drive, right field corner. It's a little short down there. Kibert's going to have to hustle. Johnson up with it. Strong throw. Kibert Ruiz, first Nats knock on his sixth double of the year. One or second, one away. Nick Senzel now standing in on the right side. A swing and a miss, and striking out is Nick Senzel. Second strikeout for Waldron, two down here in the second inning. Softly lined and caught at second base by Jake Cronenworth to end the inning. 2 2. And a ground ball base hit into right field. Well placed, not hit hard, but a single starts the second inning for Jake Cronenworth and the Padres. On a 3 2, Cronenworth takes off and a base hit into left field. Cronenworth just keeps on going. He'll take third. First and third with nobody out in the Padres' second inning. And a swing and a miss as he struck him out on that slider. Second strikeout for Corbin. First out of the second inning. First and third with one away for Ha Song Kim. 220, 10 homers, 36 runs batted in for Kim. Shows Bunt, drops it down. Coming in from third is Cronenworth. He'll score. So kind of a safety squeeze there of sorts. And the Padres get the game's first run on top one nothing. The Bunt dropped down by Ha Song Kim. First and second down with one away. And Kyle Higashioka. And sends this one to right center field. And it's going to get in. A gapper to the track of the wall. Solano will score. Here comes Kim all the way from first. He'll score. The Padres take a 3 nothing lead. Kyle Higashioka driving in a pair. Mackenzie Gore, another former Padre, tomorrow. C.J. Abrams checks one. Opposite field gap. Going to be cut off on a hop by Merrill. And the extra base hits continue for the Nats shortstop. That's number 36 on the year. So Abrams at second base, one away. Here's Lane Thomas. Strike three call gets him looking. Fastball at 90 miles an hour. Frozen. Third strikeout for Matt Waldron. Two down. 3 2 pitch coming up here to Winker. And that is ball four. First and second, and Joey Manessis coming up here. Struck out swinging. Joey, two RBIs off the team lead at 37. Runners are going. And Manessa's out to center. That ball's got some carry. It's beyond the reach of Merrill. Hits off the wall. Dang it. And the Nats will score a couple. Did that ball hit beyond the wall and come back? That's a horrible break. Hit that back wall behind the fence. So that's a break for the Padres. Just the one run scoring there for the National. So a hit and an RBI for Manessis. And now Eddie Rosario will be next. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. And they'll leave him at second and third. Extreme first base side kicks and delivers and the knuckleball hits Jacob Young. He will go to first base. The Nats have a leadoff base runner. He's hit by a pitch for the seventh time this year. So from 2-0 to 2-2 here. Nats down by a couple. Ball ripped up the middle. It eats up Kim. Young will wisely stop at second. Two on, nobody out. Swing and a miss. Needed that. Strike shot. Waker back to back strikeouts for Waldron. Seven and all, two down. Second and third, two down. Joey Manessis now. Right hander delivers. Swing and a slow tapper up the third baseline. Waldron will pick it up. He will not have a play. Young scores. Abrams to third. An infield dribbler of a hit for Joey Manessis. He's driven in both Nationals' runs. He now is tied. CJ Abrams for the club lead and runs batted in, and it's now the Padres three and the Nationals two. 
Walter has now set a career high in pitches each of the last two starts. He's got to seven strikeouts in the game tonight. And a swing and a miss. Good way to finish tonight. His eighth strikeout. Last time up, Cronenworth bounced that double play ball up the middle to our shortstop. Base hit before that got their second inning rally started. That's a fastball that freezes Cronenworth. Patrick Corbin. That is 10 in a row and 13 of the last 14. Adrian Morahone, 24 appearances, 32 and a third innings, a 2.23 ERA. Line into right field, a base hit for C.J. Abrams. His third hit of the game, three for four in this contest. Ground ball right side to the backhand is Cronenworth. His throw on a couple of hops, not in time. Beating it out is Winker and going to third is C.J. Abrams tying run now just 90 feet away. Joey Manessis already two for three a pair of RBIs tonight. Joey Manessis does it again. Sealing the deal on the first pitch. It's Joey three in the Padres three. Takes over the Nats RBI lead with number 40. Eddie Rosario will be pinch hit for here. And here comes the newest Nat Harold Ramirez. Right side and that'll be picked off by her eyes. But the Nats keep on chipping. Chopper right side Garcia on the way. Patrick Corbin is dominating. That's amazing 13 in a row and now 16 of 17. And now the inning is up to Lane Thomas. Lane Thomas drills one to left center. It's going to one hop the sign out there. And he will salvage a one for five and give his team a chance to score here in the ninth. And Jesse Winker, who has been on three times in this game, a couple walks and an infield hit, is on the ground towards shortstop. Kim will go to first base for the out. There's the inning. Bottom of the ninth inning, 3 3. Robert Garcia is on the mound. Lefty lefty with Jake Cronenworth. Garcia delivers, breaking ball, swung on, foul tip held by K. Brett Ruiz for strike three. Another scoreless inning for the Nationals who have set the Padres down in order in every inning since the fourth. We're going to extra innings here in San Diego. So the Nationals have been unable even to move Winker to third. He's still at second with two down for K. Bert Ruiz. We are tied at three. K. Bert Ruiz delivers into the right field corner. Jesse Winker scores. And for the first time, the Nats are on top. Now we'll see if Nick Senzel can bring Ruiz home. Nick yeah. Senzel, deep left field. See you later. A three run tenth for the Nets. Just channeling that Tennessee Volunteer World Series championship tonight with his own two run bomb. Petco Park, where we go to the bottom of the 10th inning. Nationals getting a three spot in the top of the 10th to take a 6 3 lead. In the air to left field, struck pretty well. Winker's going back out of the warning track. That ball's going to one hop the wall. Cronenworth is going to be stopped at third, and it's second and third with nobody out. You're going to have the time run coming to the plate with nobody out here in the 10th. Line to center field, a base hit for Merrill. One run is in. Here comes Solano. Two runs are in. It's now six to five. Winning run into scoring position now for the Padres with just the one out. Little pop fly. Nick Senzel after it. He is going to make the play what in foul play. ground. What a play, Nick Senzel. Great jump to go get this. Put right near the low wall. And what a pitch when he needed it most. Hunter Harvey, nicely done. They intentionally walk a rise, so it'll be Profar with the bases loaded now. Not taking their chances with a rise. Profar hits it towards right center field. Long run for Lane Thomas. They're going to get there. Up and over. Two-run score. And the Padres. 